Say man, hey man. It's your boy Do It All Holland. We're back with another NBA 2K24 Next Gen Beer video. But before I get into the build, I need you guys to do me a huge favor. Let me know in the comments what's your favorite type of pie. Okay, what kind of pie you like. And if you watch life, then you, <laughs> you might like. <laughs> Oh man, I was just thinking about that that pie joke on uh, life. But anyway, um, make sure you hit the link in the description to subscribe to my home YouTube channel called The Guys in the Recovery Room Podcast. But we're gonna get into this bill, man. This is a six foot ten big body Benz bill, and I'm pretty sure you guys would like it. So watch the video to the end so I can show you this masterpiece. To the hand of your choice and the jersey number of your choice. Let's get it, man. As you can see, we are going with six foot ten for this particular bill. Like I said, 218 pounds for the weight. You still have good speed to be six ten. You still have good strength to be 6'10 and we have a 7 foot wingspan so that means you still can shoot I'm not going to give this bill super high shooting because I don't want to take the wingspan down too low but what I will give you is enough to do what you need to do but let's get into it so this bill is really a finisher um, we want to focus on the finishing with this bill when you're 6 foot 10 you unlock the big man contact dunk so we want the big man contact dunks we want the pro contact dunks and we want the elite contact dunk so with that being said we are going to take the driver dunk to a 94 and that does give us what we need the reason I didn't take the wingspan down anymore because let me show you what I'm talking about if you want more three-point shooting right look at this look at the driver dunk it goes down as you take the wingspan down we don't want it at a 93 we want it at a 94 so we can get those elite contact dunk so that's why I did what I did I just wanted to show you guys that so the 94 driver dunk is what we have we get gold poster rise we get Hall of Fame slithery Hall of Fame bunny Hall of Fame two-step and spin cycle as far as the layup we're gonna get that up to an 80 normally I'll leave that at a 74 but I decided to take it up to an 80 and this standing dunk mm -mm -mm. 92 on the standing dunk a lot of people go to 90 you know what I'm saying they be like oh this is enough to get the contact dunks or whatnot but why not go to a 92 and get fast twitch on goal I want that okay a lot of people probably say oh it, it, it worked the same yeah whatever 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 okay but we got gold fast twitch we got gold rise up gold precision gold area wizard and we're going to come down to the physical so we're going to go ahead and take the speed up take the acceleration up take the strength up to an 84 we still will be able to get um silver move but force the silver brick wall silver fearless silver bulldozer and that's pretty good um the vertical a lot of people make this mistake too please don't make the mistake and not take your vertical up to an 82 so you can get those contact dunks, all right? And we're gonna go back up, as you can see, um, you do get what I said, you will get gold poster rides and a lot of other badges on this build. Fearless finisher, we got acrobat, we got a lot of other good finishing badges on this build too. But let's go ahead and get it to the green bean, make your girl scream badge. Like I said, I didn't want to take the wingspan down too much and make you guys lose the driving dunk just to get a little bit more three-point shooting, but you still have a pretty good three-point shot on this build with an 80. Now, if you want more, like I said, I showed you what's going to happen if you change the wingspan. So changing the wingspan does take away from the build when it comes to the finish aspect of it but if you need more three-point shooting which a lot of people do I totally understand go ahead and take it up you know what I'm saying as far as the mid-range you can leave it right there at a 65 if you want to that's totally up to you but we did take it to a 72 for this build and the free throw is a 76 so we do have good free throw in this build we do have um, some pretty good three-point shooting in my opinion now if you like I said if you can't make it work with that 80 Go ahead and change it, but you do get silver blinder, silver catcher suit, silver corner specialist. You got dead eye on the bill. You got agent on the bill. You got claymore, green machine, guard up, open looks. So you still have, and also space creator and spot finder. So you still have some good badges on this bill that will allow you to do what you need to do. Anytime it comes to shooting, um, you know, you want to have some badges on silver. Um, this badge, I don't think this bill has a gold badge or a comeback here. That don't, that don't even count. But we don't have no gold badges on the bill. But just think about this. You really a slasher. For real, for real. You really a six foot ten slasher because of the driving dunk that you have with this bill and the ability to get to the rim. Okay, but let's go ahead and get it to the south. But before we do, I need you guys to do me a huge favor, right? Go down there, hit that like button, hit that subscribe button, hit that share button, and let the video play to the end because that will push the video to the recommended page so everybody mama can see this video and I need everybody mama to see the video so do that for your boy boy now as far as the pass accuracy we're not going to focus too much on that um you can take it up high if you want to 
But we did take it to a 69. That's enough to give us um, some bronze badge. We got break starter, we got diamond, relay passer, and special delivery. Just in case you want to make some bounce pass or try to throw an alley, I think that's good enough. Um, I got a 25 passing on one of my bills, and it does just fine. And then you click on other bills, and they got more passing, and they throwing beach balls out there, man. You know what I'm saying? It don't make sense to me sometimes the way that this game played. Yesterday, we wanted the t most... Oh my God! Yesterday was terrible for me, man. For me and my squad, everybody was missing shots, and it's like I don't, I, I just don't get it sometimes with 2K, man. Because you go out there, you want to try to play the game every day, and you want to try to, you know, keep the, keep the game alive. You know what I'm saying? But 2K make it hard for you when you go out there, and nobody on the team can hit a shot. Okay, it's like I, I just don't get it. You know what I'm saying? But for the ball handle, we're going to take that to a 76. As far as the speed with ball, we're going to max that out at a 69. You can adjust that if you want to. That's totally up to you, but you will lose hyperdrive if you want to adjust that. Um, so we got hyperdrive, we got triple strike, we got blow by, and we have big drive on Hall of Fame. We also have gold um, physical handles with this build as well. So um, you should be able to get to the rim with this build um, and not have a problem because some people, they can't really dribble with the six foot 10 builds. I can dribble with it just fine. You know, it's not like another build, six nine, six eight, six seven. you know, like that. But, um, you know, if you, you figure out a good um, setup, you know what I'm saying, you can be able to get to the rim at will. But let's go ahead and get it to the defense. Now with the defense, um, I was thinking more of like being at power forward. Like if you make a small forward, they may put you at power forward. If you make a power forward, they may put you at center. If you make a center, they may put you at power forward. You know what I'm saying? Like this stuff is crazy. So I wanted to make this build um, equip for those situations and take the interior defense up to a 74. Um, that does give us post lockdown and once we take the block up, which we will take that up to 87 You could do a 79. I think a 79 should get the job done at small forward It just depends on what you want. You know what I'm saying? You can get the job done with that or maybe even a 78 because you're gonna get a uh, pogo with the rebounder So um, with this build we did take it to an 87. Some people may want to do a 79 and try to get more um, perimeter defense, which I left the perimeter defense right there. You don't really, you know, it's, it's not going to make a huge, it's going to make a difference, you know what I'm saying, if you get it up in the 70s or whatnot for certain badges. But um, I think we fine, man. You should be good if you know how to play defense. If you don't know how to play defense, first of all, don't even make no 6 foot 10 bill. Make your bill that can give you clamp. This bill can't give you clamp. So um, that's what we got. We didn't add any steel. Um, steel is expensive, and we wanted to focus on the main thing with this bill. So we got that 87 block, uh, chase down all on goal, silver anchor, silver pogo. Uh, for the rebound, we got an offensive rebound of 85, which is uh, super good. Okay, uh, we got a 76 speed, uh, 68 acceleration, 84 strength, 82 vert, and the rest is on stamina. Now let's get into these shades of are you ready because guess what i do not click back here we go here we go here we go now so they're probably going to give us uh yeah t mac michael porter jr and brandon ingram and the bill name is the infamous inside out score that's the bill make sure you like the video share the video subscribe to the channel let me know in the comments what's your favorite pie subscribe to my home youtube channel called the guys in the recovery room podcast and i'm out of here man Charge!